and welcome to another instructional video by RapidFireKits.co.uk This is the video to show you how to put everything back together after you've installed all your modifications so we've done thumbsticks, bumpers, all your buttons, your d-pad and your mic plate we've got it all apart, now it's literally banging it all back together all you need for this is the T8 security or T8H screwdriver and your seven screws and all your parts, and it's as simple as that now your best bet is to keep all your buttons facing downwards on your controller like so, everything down that way that it doesn't fall out. And you get your circuit board with your thumbsticks on. And I find it easiest to put the thumbsticks in first. You'll hear it sort of click into places, everything slowly slots in. Then to get your rumble motors and put them in the little cradles that they uh, they belong in. You'll uh, you'll know which it sort of slots into place. And then everything fits quite snugly. It all slots together. Just press it a little bit to make sure it's in the right spot, but you can literally tell that that's, that's right. As I tip it back upside down, they will fall out. The next step is to put the back casing on, like so. Uh, and the, I find the easiest way to do this is to put it so the battery clips sliding in on the bottom, like so. And you get a nice little click as everything slowly slots into place. And that's his controller looking. A little bit snazzy, a lot brighter than before. Very simple modification to do. Very, very simple. Everything works, all your buttons can press. Right, now to screw it back in, you've got seven screws as before. Now I find often the easiest way is simply just to slot them in the little holes that come with these bottom four. Like so, and then start screwing them in. As it be, as it's a little pain, it'll not do it for me. There we go. And uh, tighten it up, not too tight. Uh, snug, I think the uh, the term would be quite snug. Uh, go on. There we go. I eventually found it. Now the easiest way to do this top is to literally place the screw on top of the screwdriver. Line it with a hole, and in it goes like so. Same again with this one, and screw it in like so. Now you don't want to do these too tight. If you find it, it's not working 100% like you want to. Just slacken it off a little bit. You've done it a little bit too tight, and then it works perfectly. And you hear that nice little clicking noise. Too tight. I'll show you again. And it'll not simply not click. This one clicks. This one doesn't. So it's slacking it off half a turn. I'd say. You get the idea. Right. The final one is the screw right through the middle of the barcode again, and that just holds all the middle of the controller down together. Screw in and you're good to game. As your controller, all the back up, fully modified, nice and simple, easy PC. For more installation videos, check out all the other videos. And for all custom parts, check out www.rapidfiredkits.co.uk. Let's check back on and we're done. Thanks and goodbye.